and our next workout, you guys are gonna rest anywhere from 30 seconds to a minute in between sets. You guys wanna be comfortably challenged, but still make sure you're challenged. Should be hard, guys. For our warm up, we're gonna do 35 ice skaters, 55 jumping jacks, and we're gonna jump rope for two minutes. Make sure you guys go as hard as you can on the warm up. That way you're fully warm for our amazing high intensity workout. For our first exercise, we're gonna do three sets of 15 side lunges to press. So you guys are gonna go take your five pound dumbbells, you're gonna go into that side lunge that we've been so good at doing, keeping that front foot straight. You're gonna have your shoulders back and you're gonna press up once that foot hits the ground. You're gonna bring your foot back to center and you do the opposite side. So we're gonna go for three sets of 15 on each leg, so 30 total. For our next exercise, we're gonna do three sets of 15 walking lunges with five pounds in each hand. The most important thing is that your knee's not going over your toe and that you're leaning just slightly forward with your shoulders back and the weights right next to your side. You guys can do this anywhere. And our next exercise, we're gonna do 10 squat leaps. So you're gonna have your shoulders back, your knees slightly bent, just pushing off from your glutes. You're really using the back of your legs to just drive you forward. Making sure that you guys land between your toe and your heel. Soft landing, knees bent. Just keep on going. I know you guys can do this. And our next high intensity interval move, we're gonna do 10 inchworms. You guys are gonna start feet hip width apart and you're gonna walk your hands out in push up position. You're gonna hold there for a couple seconds and then you're gonna walk it right back to stand. For our next exercise, we're gonna do 50 jumping jacks. You wanna move those hands and feet as fast as you can, arms straight up over your head. For our next move, we're gonna do three sets of 15 side squats. You're gonna start off with your feet hip width apart into low squat position, having the back of your legs parallel to the ground. We're just gonna move out 15 times to the right, and then you're gonna move out 15 times to the left. If you guys want this to be more challenging, I would suggest the two five pound dumbbells in each hand for the best results. For our next exercise, we're gonna do three sets of 30 glute raises. You're gonna lift your right leg up, knee bent, as high as you can go and come back down. Repeat for 30 sets on that right leg, and then we're gonna go to the other leg and do the same thing. Making sure that your back is not arching and your core is really engaged. Our next exercise is three sets of 30 glute raises on the ground. So you're gonna lay on your back and you're gonna bend your knees and you're just gonna lift one leg up, other leg straight, lift as high as you can and come down without letting your booty touch the ground. Shoulders back, guys. You can press your hands into the ground if you need a little bit of help. And you're gonna hold as high as you can and come back down. You guys did such a great workout. Now it's time to stretch it out. We're gonna start with our hamstrings. You're gonna have your left leg in front of you, reaching down for your toes. You're gonna hold there for 30 seconds. And then we're gonna switch legs to make sure your other leg is elongated as well. Then we're gonna do a hip flexor stretch. Bring one knee out in front and you're just gonna lean forward into a hip flexor stretch. This is really important because the more you stretch your muscles, the more pliable they can be and the more movement you'll get and the more calories you'll burn. Opposite leg, guys, same thing, hold for 30 seconds. The last stretch we're gonna do is a pigeon pose. This is stretching the exact area that we worked so you guys will get the best results possible with your stretching. Hold for 30 seconds on each side. I hope you've enjoyed our Balance Bar Summer Shape Up workout. Remember to have at least 30 minutes of exercise a day and to fuel your workouts with our amazing Balance Bar cookie dough and peanut butter flavors.